Welcome back. Now that we are familiar with basic navigation, it's time to explore some of the options that the Stack Navigator supports. In this video, we will dive into specifying a screen title, styling headers, and setting content styles. Let's begin with the title. Every screen in our stack can display a title in the header, serving as a handy guide for users to understand their current location within the app. By default, the name prop on the screen component is showcased as the screen title. For instance, on our devices, it displays home and about. However, this can be customized by specifying a title option. So options is the prop name. Specify an object with key title and let's set it to welcome home. If we head back to the device, the home screen title now reads welcome home. Moving beyond the title, it's often desirable to style the header to resonate with the application's theme. This includes setting the background color, text color, and font width among other attributes. For that, you can set header style, which is an object, and we set background color, header tint color, and header title style, font width, bold. Save the file and head back to the device. And you can see a purple background, white font color, and a bold font weight for the title. Next, we have the header left and header right options, which allow adding custom components to the left and right of the header. Let's add a simple button on the right hand side of the title. So, header right is the option. And this is going to be equal to a function that returns a component. We're going to import pressable from React Native, which is auto-imported in my case, a text component, which also needs to be auto-imported from React Native, with the text menu. For pressable, I'm going to add an onPress prop with a simple alert that displays menu button pressed. For the text, I'm going to specify the style prop where we set color to white. Let's also add font size and specify 16. Take a look at the devices and we have a pressable menu element on the right hand side. Alert, menu button pressed. Similar to header right, there is also header left option, which adds an element on the left side of the header. Now, React Navigation also provides an option to style the content of our screens using the content style option. For instance, setting a background color is as simple as setting content style to an object with background color to a hex value. Our screen background now has a faint shade of the header purple color. It's crucial to note that these options are screen specific. On navigating to the about screen, the styles do not follow. For a more uniform style across all screens in the stack, you need to lift these options to the stack navigator using the screen options prop. So you specify screen options. And here, all the styling options on the individual screen can be moved, though the title remains a screen level prop. So from header style, all the way to content style. Cut and paste it. Head back to the devices. And we can see the theme styling apply to both the screens. All right, in the next video, let's look at dynamic Stack Navigator options with React Navigation. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.